One in 19 million. Some headlines claim those are your chances of getting coronavirus. Sounded fishy to our Verify team, so they got to the bottom of it. The Verify team exists to get the facts on misinformation spreading online. And with COVID-19, it can be really hard to keep track of the latest numbers. Like this new viral claim spreading across Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. It says that a study found that the average 50 to 64 year old has a one in 19 million chance of dying from COVID-19. So let's verify, are those numbers legit? Here are sources, a study from Stanford and UCLA, as well as one of the authors of that study, Dr. Rajiv Bhatia, an assistant professor of medicine at Stanford University. Our researchers started by tracing this claim back to an article by One America News Network. This claim comes directly from their headline. The OAN article then links to this study by researchers at Stanford and UCLA. Our Verify researchers read through that study and that one in 19 million statistic is never mentioned. So next our researchers contacted Dr. Rajiv Bhatia, one of the study's authors. He told us that the headline is quote, a misrepresentation of the study and its findings. Dr. Bhatia says the study is not meant to estimate a nationwide likelihood of contracting or dying from COVID-19. It simply sets out to show another method for calculating the average risk of someone contracting a severe disease, in this case COVID-19, in a typical large U.S. county. The study even points out a number of unknown factors that would limit the accuracy of an actual risk analysis. On top of all that, Dr. Bhatia tells us that the study is still being revised and is under peer review. So we can verify that no, this study did not find that there's a one in 19 million chance of a 50 to 64 year old dying from COVID-19. With your Verify, this is Evan Kozlov.